What's going on everyone? Justin again as always. Thanks for watching my channel. Welcome back. Today we're going to talk about real briefly why you should not buy anything cordless and why you shouldn't buy a contractor kit right now. Coming up. But first, let's go see what they got at the depot. Alright, so checking out the Makita lineup, which we've seen before. They have some pretty nice selection of cordless tools here. Some new, most old, most a little bit, kind of last year or year before last specials. Uh, I think they're just trying to clear out inventory, which is why there is some empty spaces. Here's their new brushless lineup, the LXT. All in black, smaller, more torque, brushless. Damn, don't those things look good. I'm digging it. I really am. I'm kind of wondering what to what they got going on. I, I want to see what's getting ready to happen. Dewalt, still pretty impressive lineup. Still pretty good variety when it comes to tools. Not going to be talking about prices too much, and I'll explain why here momentarily. But again, talking about some of the new products they're coming out with the XR model. A lot of people really like that half inch impact, some drills and stuff. Notice that you're not seeing too many kits right now. This is also going to be coming up in this video discussion topic today. Why are there not any kits really? There's only like maybe a two piece kit, most of them individual sets. Let's look at their new 20 volt lineup. This stuff looking pretty cool. I was looking at this. Uh, cutting saw and I was like man that, that looks pretty nice long reach kind of getting to some tight spots 150 if you have a Dewalt kit already might be a nice new addition more power size meets power now looking at the Milwaukee stuff real briefly for my Milwaukee guys out there yeah they still kind of got it going on but again a lot of gen 1 and some fuel gen 2 stuff on the shelf haven't seen any gen 3 yet uh, there's a reason why there's some gaps and why some of this stuff is aged. Looking at some of the rigid, still using the uh, X4 and the X5 model. A lot of empty spaces. Again, getting ready to talk about this, but before we do, we're going to get past this now. They do have a contractor kit with rigid, and we're going to take a look here at the Ryobi stuff because Ryobi had a contractor kit available too, still. But why didn't Makita Dewalt or Milwaukee have a contractor kit? That's pretty important. Why are some of the shelves blank? Why isn't there some new tools put on the shelf? Let's talk about that. So I was talking with an associate at Home Depot about why there wasn't any contractor kits available for the Makita, the Dewalt, the Milwaukee lineup, because we all know that they do sell a contractor kit, but why aren't we seeing it on the shelf? And why are some of the shelves blank? And how come there's still a lot of the old stuff and we're not seeing the new stuff? And her reason was because Labor Day is coming, they're starting to clear out a lot of the inventory, push sales to get rid of the stuff that's already there to make room for new inventory, new products getting ready to come out. You're here in about three or four weeks, they're going to be putting a lot of new center islands together throughout the store with some of the newer and latest and greatest uh, kits available, not just contractor kits, but little tiny kits like the drill bit kits and drills and angle grinders and leaf blowers probably and some more cordless weed whacker stuff I don't know look but they got a lot of new products and innovative stuff coming out here real real soon but you're gonna want to catch those contractor kits specifically on days like Labor Day Memorial Day Black Friday Christmas sales Father's Day I don't think they have a Mother's Day special. If they did, that might be kinda cool too. Gives us an extra holiday during the year to get more on sale stuff. So why is it a terrible time to buy cordless stuff right now? Why is it a terrible time for you to pick up a contractor kit right now? Because new and more innovative products are coming out with here really, really soon within the next month. And you're going to want to catch those specials anyways on some of those holidays that I just got done mentioning. That's when you're going to get the best deal that you possibly can for those bigger kits. Then from there throughout the year, as you see certain items go on sale, you can add to your kit. But hey, let me know what you are looking for, what you hope to see in the coming month, and what kind of tools that you're thinking about possibly picking up, or what contractor kit you're possibly thinking about picking up here come Labor Day. I want to know. Put it down in the comments. Thanks as always for watching. Cheers to those of you that have your beers. We'll see you next time. Deuces.